Adam for Adam, he's going to be going home, but Mike joining Andrew Redwood, Gaz Wider, and Carl Reuterman in your top four. First battle for the top four, round one. Gaz Wider and Andrew Redwood, both S14 Sylvias, three S14 Sylvias in the top four. The top four, what we've all been waiting for, separating the men from the boys. Gaz Wider taking on Andrew Redwood. Gaz taking the lead, putting up a smoke screen early in the run. Redwood not backing off whatsoever, coming in into the second turn. Nice and close on that flipping point. Through to the second flipping point. Redwood is not backing off whatsoever, coming into the hairpin. Gaz, Redwood. This could be anyone's run. Right on that clipping point from both drivers. Redwood throwing the car around like nobody's business. Too close to call from me, JT. Let's get straight into that second pass. Redwood taking the lead on the second pass. Full lock through the first corner. Even more than Gaz Wider, but Gaz is nice and close coming through the second clipping point. Slightly wide from Redwood. Gaz, smoke just steaming off the back tyres, coming into the hairpin. Gaz doesn't want to let down. Nice and close. The judges have spoken, JT. A slight advantage to Gaz in the first pass. The second pass, they call it 50-50, but Gaz is going to be stepping through to yet another final. Redwood got to be happy, but he's not going into the final. It's between these two guys to see who will be taking on Gaz. Mad Mike, the Red Bull RX-7, Carl Reutemann, Mr. Consistent in the ENH Motors S14. First battle, Carl Reutemann looks to be taking the lead. Mad Mike doesn't want to give it up. Power flat to the floor from both cars coming into the second clipping point. Mike clips it again, splats off his front bumper coming into the hairpin. Mike slightly low. I don't know who's got this one. Well, the last time these drivers met in Taupo, Mad Mike defeated Carl. Before that in Christchurch, Mad Mike also defeated Carl. Let's check out the second pass. It's all on the judges now. Mike doing his best to lay down a smoke screen for Carl Reutemann. Through to the second clipping point, Mike nice and close. Reutemann doesn't want to let down into the hairpin. Both cars, no one can gain on each other. The judges can't separate them. JT and I can't separate them. The judges are going to send them to a rerun. The crowd is screaming one more time, JT. These drivers can't be separated into the final corner. Mad Mike right up there in the chase, shadowing everything Reutemann does, but Reutemann not putting a foot wrong. The judges have spoken. JT, we are going to see our first double rerun in NZ Drift history. Mad Mike with a huge understeer through the first corner, goes slightly wide on the second corner, drops a wheel off, but could the judges see it from their point of view? Obviously they can, JT, because they've scored the first pass, 75-25 to Reutemann. No pressure on Reutemann now, all the pressure on Mad Mike. What can he do? Mike doing a nice clean run so far. Reutemann nice and close coming into the hairpin. Reutemann squeezing up on him. Takes a spin on the last corner. No pressure on Reutemann at all and he's spun. Mad Mike through to the final. Let's see our third and fourth playoff. Reutemann taking on Redwood in the Nankang performance ties S14. Reutemann turning in nice and early on the first corner. Flips the second. Redwood nowhere to be seen so far. Can he catch him? A little bit less drifting from Redwood so far coming into the hairpin and Redwood's not scared whatsoever. The judges are going to call this 60-40 advantage, Reutemann, but don't discount Andrew Redwood. He's put in a great performance today. Can he push Reutemann all the way? Redwood initiating way earlier, coming through nice and close to that second clipping point. This is fantastic drifting from Andrew Redwood. Can he keep it up to the end of the run? Look at him laying down that smoke screen. Carl Reutemann making the mistake he can't see, doesn't know where to go. Redwood, great drifting all day, but the first pass advantage from Reutemann will be taking him home third spot. But why are we here, JT? We've been building towards the final. Mad White with death taking on Gaz Wider. So under the darkening clouds, we've finally made it to the final between Gaz Wider and his S14.5 and Mad Mike and the Red Bull RX-7. It's the big two of New Zealand drifting in the final. It'll come down to who makes the mistake. Mike, huge understeer through the first corner. Gaz Wider, nice and clean line so far. Mad Mike doing his best to repair his situation through turn two and turn three. Coming into the final corner. 
Mike doesn't want to let it go. Nice and close though. Close as anyone's been all day. He's not given up so far. Mad Mike, nice and tight in the chase there. We saw the end, he puts the power down, but that slight mistake at the start might ruin it for him. It's all up to the second pass. Mike initiates nice and early, tries to lay down that smoke screen for Gaz. Gaz is not giving up whatsoever, coming through to the second clipping point. Both nice and close, you can see Gaz just about dipping his wheel in the dirt. In the hairpin, look at Gaz here, right up on the inside of Mike. Will this win it for Gaz Wider? The judges will have to tell us. I try to come in real tight on you. Yeah. Like, come, oh, come in too fast. Like oh, I come in just too hot, just trying to stay too close. But uh, oh man, that was good fun. <laughs> <laughs> what a workout! They're so somebody matched. Um, you got full, full confidence in Mike's drive. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it just makes it for a better show for the fans, and uh, that's what we want. With a points lead and champion of the first round, make some noise for Gaz Wider. Gaz Wider, he just keeps on winning. Number one. <laughs> Gaz Wider is a modest builder from Fungas in the weekdays, but when it comes to competition driving, he will not let anyone or anything stand in his way. This has been round one of the 2009 New Zealand Drift Series in association with NAC Insurance. Now Gaz Wider taking home top position today, but I know for all these drivers, it'll be all on come round two. Roll on July the 12th, Pukekohe Park Raceway. Be there or be square, don't miss it.